This is Bash Ty Hurd here with ADSN at lovely Bank of America Stadium where we are wrapping up the Panthers versus the Ravens game. Carolina won decisively by a score of 36 to 21. We talked to Ron Rivera after the game where he told us that this was the most complete game on all phases of the ball that Carolina's had this season. I think our guys came out and did some good things. Um, in all three phases, you know, defense a little disappointed. We came out in that first series, we were a little discombobulated in terms of, of being able to settle in, get them into some, some positive situations for us. We didn't, we missed some tackles early on. Um, but I think once they settled in, I think we got a feel for what, what, uh, what to anticipate. Thought uh, Eric did a nice job calling the defenses. On the offensive side, I, I just think we had a really good rhythm. I think uh, Norv mixed the personnel in very well. Uh, Cam made some great decisions and, uh, and, and really just pleased with that. Uh, we played great complimentary football. What'd I say? Uh, we played great complimentary football and uh, it started with the defense. Um, and even though special teams, we got a great field position by a good spot on the, on the punt return. And, um, you know, thanks to Kirko and, 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 and uh, Pilardi and those guys. And we just wanted to do a good job and capitalize on a great field position. The Carolina Panthers struggled on defense the majority of the first quarter, but I noticed a decisive shift in tone after the Ravens decided to go for it on fourth and one from their own 10, and the Panthers noticed it too. That was it's kind of rude. <laughs> it's kind of rude when it comes to football. And they did. It was like, wow, they really going to do this? And uh, it definitely ramped us up defensively-wise. It was like, man, we, we need some respect. You know, so we try to just go out there and you know make plays and, and, and earn our respect. Since they weren't gonna give it to us and do that, we wanted to go out there and shut them down and earn it. And Mike touched on that a lot on the sideline. You know, he felt like felt like we was disrespecting him and Luke and TD. You know, so those guys really got us fired up after that and um, everything else. We were just clicking on all cylinders. Oh, they were just saying that, you know, they went for it on foot, you know, in our territory, you know, they don't respect us and stuff like that. And um, that's kind of how we felt as a defense to get get the stop and um, get them off the field. This may be the most complete win for the Carolina Panthers, but it's not a time to get complacent. They have another game here at Bank of America Stadium where they'll be facing the Buccaneers next Sunday. You just got to remember these moments, you know, how good winning feels, um, you know, how fun the locker room is after wins and how hard that is. You know, you can't just all of a sudden now because you've won a few good games that you're going to all of a sudden show up and they're going to keep coming. So you got to just channel this, bottle this and say, all right, what did it take to, to get to this point? We need to continue to do that every week. And um, it's easier said than done, but I think over the years we've shown that we, we're mature enough that we can do that. So that's the hope. The Panthers advance to 5-2 and two with this 36-21 victory over the Ravens. Make sure you're tuning in to ADSN, ADSN1.com for all of your Panthers news. Thanks for joining us.